we are going to continue creating our game view our game view is going to look like this first we are going to have an image view which is an image that is going to be changing with the game then we are going to have here the uh, text view which is going to be the letters that we have failed then we are going to have a linear layout which will contain some text view every letter is going to be a text view and we will show the, the letter that we introduced correctly and we will show the letter that we still need to guess okay and finally we are going to have a linear layout with a uh, with a text view an edit text edit text is used to introduce text on the application and a button okay so to get this image you need to download the assets and you can get the assets from here I have the assets here already the asset is a zip document you can extract it and as you can see here we will have all the all the image of the game so when you fail the first, le the first letter we will show the head of the android and we will go like, like this until you finish and this will be game over okay so copy the image paste the image on Dragon now we have the asset and we can continue creating the view open the view in the activity game XML let's start creating the image view first we can come here add the image view the image view is going to be at the top the image view need to have a source which is going to be the image this can be this is going to be the first one first image okay we are going to set a height for the image view you can adjust this height to your mobile if you want I am going to use 400p I am going to set a margin at the top okay now that on the relative layout I have some padding and margin before but I have, I have removed all of them I don't want any padding on the relative layout just match padding and match padding okay the next thing that I need is a linear layout at the bottom check that align parent is at the bottom the width and the weight is going to be gap content if not it will take on the screen so it won't be at the bottom okay content add a text view to that linear layout set a margin like 10p from the bottom 10p okay then add a edit text to the linear layout now that I have a rendering problem here is because I'm having problem with the Android 4.4 so change this to API 19 and it will be fine so then we need to add a button which is going to be the button that we press when we introduce the letter okay we have everything if I come to the element of the middle I can set a margin to the left and a margin to the right okay so they are a bit more spaces okay now to this layout I'm going to add a margin at the bottom so in margin bottom I'm going to add 20 dp okay no that's too much 10 dp okay and I'm going to add a background to this layout because we already have a gradient drawable I am going to use that one so I'm going to use the gradient background okay 
And now this linear algebra is going to take all the width, so it can show all the gradient. I'm going to have a margin on the left. Okay. So now change the text, property text, insert letter. Okay, so the letter will be here. Change the text at the bottom. Check the letter. Okay. Now we need to set an ID to this layout, and this is going to be layout add letter. Okay. Now I'm going to add my next layout, which is going to be the one containing the letters, which is, I'm going to drop it here, as you can see, above layout add letter. So, it's going to be above. I'm going to start adding text view. The text is going to be an underscore. The layout width and height is going to be graph content. Okay. Now I'm going to copy this element and I'm going to paste it four times. So I have four space for four letters here. I'm going to have a, I'm going to add a margin at the right for every one of them and I'm going to add a margin at the bottom on the whole layout. Okay. I'm going to change the size of the text. None of them. Okay, this is an example with four letters, but we will see later how to create this for a random number of letters. Okay, uh, this is going to be layout letters. Okay, so the only thing that we need now is the letters that you see when you fail on the screen, which is a text view, a text view which is going to be is going to be around here. It's going to have a margin from the top with 120 dp. So I need a text view on the relative layout at the top, which is going to, to have like 200 dp from the top and 20 dp from the, from the left. Okay, and the text color is going to be red, so I'm going to create a color red. Okay, so now text color, color red. Okay, and I'm going to remove the text from now because this is not going to show anything until you fail a letter. Okay, so that's all.